Dusty, do you have a minute? What I do now? Nothing, and I want to thank you for that. For keeping my distance from Meg? Yes. I didn't think you could do it, but you actually let the police handle things for once. Well, it doesn't seem like they're making much progress. Eliza and Paul are still missing. Well, that may change now that Meg's done the video. What kind of video? One where she speaks directly to Paul and asks him to bring Eliza home. What are you going to do with it? I already put it up on the internet. Are you serious? Yeah. You got to take it down, Bonnie. Why? Because if Paul sees it, it's going to drive him further into hiding. That video is a big mistake if Paul sees it. Well, it's too late. It's already out there, and we can't take it back. I wish you had run this by me first. It wasn't your decision to make. I would have warned you. Bonnie, hey, we found them. What? Where? In Wisconsin. I'm going there now. Yourself? Yeah, that's what they asked me to do. Who did? We got a response from someone who saw the video. They showed me a picture of Eliza, and they said they wanted to give her back to me. What do they want in return? Nothing. Just for you to meet them alone? Yeah. Doesn't sound right. I agree. I think we need to tell the police. No, we can't do that. They said not to. How do you know this is legit? Because the destination, it's near where Paul was hiding before when he asked Barbara to meet him. When was this? Look, it doesn't matter. I just want to make sure that all the paperwork is in order when I bring Eliza home. It is. Everything's been filed. So I have custody? Full custody. There's even a restraining order out on Paul. Okay, good. Because I don't want him anywhere near my daughter. You know, Meg, I just have to ask you one more time. Are you sure that you don't want to inform the police about this? Yes, I am sure. I'm going to do exactly what they want me to do, and I don't care what it is as long as I get my daughter back. I have to go. Wait a second. You don't look good if you are. Dusty, look, I'm fine, okay? I already told you it's, it's nerves. Are you sure, Meg? Yes. Yes, look, I, I'm a nurse. I would know if something was wrong, and, and it's not. As much as I hate to agree with Dusty, you do look a bit flushed. But, look, it's just stress, okay? It, it's going to stop once I get my daughter back. All right, then allow me to go with you. No! I won't interfere. I'll keep my distance, I promise. But I would feel better if I knew that you weren't going out there alone. Right? I feel better if you don't go at all. Okay, you're not going to stop me, okay? So don't even try. I'm not going to lose my daughter again. What if you're walking into a trap? The email is said to come alone, and I'm going to do exactly as they tell me to. Now I need to go. I didn't have enough to eat this morning, okay? I'll, I'll just grab something on the way I was coming. No, 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 no. You're going to the hospital. You gotta get checked out. No, I am going to get my daughter. You're in no shape to travel. I'll go. I'm going with you. No, no, neither of you is going. Why Do you not? Hear me? Why? Because whoever I'm supposed to meet is expecting a woman, not the two of you. What if I went? Bonnie. No, you said they're expecting a woman. Meg, let me go in your place. I might be less intimidating Things to get them. out of hand. How are you going to protect I'm yourself? I'm a lawyer, Dusty. You have no idea what you're walking no, into. No, if there is negotiating to be done, I can do it. And if Paul's nearby, I can cut a deal with him, too. Do you think these guys can be reasoned with? Dusty, are you sure you want to do this? I want to bring your little girl home, Meg. Thank you. Promise me you'll be careful. I will. What are you going to do? I'm just going to sit here and wait. I'll take upstairs. We'll get somebody to eat from room service, and she can rest until she gets stronger. What if that doesn't do the trick? I'll take her to the hospital. And Damien. Don't fight me on this, please. You okay to walk? Yeah, just, just go slow. Call me the minute you hear anything, okay? Yeah, I will. I will. Thank you. I better get to Wisconsin if I'm going to make it in time. I'm going with you. The hell you are. You can't do this alone. Why not? Because I'm a woman? Because you have no idea what's waiting for you on the other Maybe night. not, but at least I know I will not have to worry about you. Worry about me? Doing what? I don't know. Pulling out a gun, shooting someone. And what's your excuse going to be then, Dusty? Public service. Mm. <laughs> you want to perform a public service? 
and stand down and let me do my job. What the hell are you doing here? I'm watching you. That's some no, lean you got there. I told there. you to stay in Yeah, Oakdale. I know what you told me. So where are they? I don't know. Maybe they saw you watching me and you scared them off, Dusty. Or maybe they're not coming at all. Give it up, Bonnie. They're not coming. It's because you scared them off, Dusty. They're over an hour late. This whole thing was a hoax. Just like you said it was? Go to hell. Where are you going? Why, are you planning on following me again? Good luck to you, sweetheart. You could still make it. Just drop me off first. What are you waiting for? Drive. My car's just down the road. I need a tow. It won't start. Got one truck, and it's on a run right now. Well, how long am I going to have to wait? Maybe an hour, two, tops. Uh, have fun. Oh, wait. You just can't leave me here. Sorry, I'm under strict orders. I got to get down to hell. Oh, no, you don't. Look around. This is hell. So you're gonna stay right where you are. Why do you want me to stick around? To protect your pricey shoes from all the Come dirt? Come on, you know what? Get over yourself. Well, you're the one who wants me to stick around. Well, just in case my car can't be fixed and I need a ride home, Dusty. You get your ride, I'll get mine. Look, look, if this whole Eliza thing is just a big hoax, where do you have to be anyway? Out there looking for it. Come on, honestly, how long is it gonna take to get my car in here for you to look at it? Man, are all you people from Illinois this impatient? It's the water. Wait a sec. You said all you people from Illinois. Has someone else from Illinois been here? When? Two or three days ago. Was it a man with a baby, a little baby girl? He was ticked we couldn't fix his car fast enough. Paul's here. 